Hello, I'm Mac Brown. In the last video we showed you how to do a Mac knot for tying the fly on. I'm going to show you how we use that in combination with the Davy knot to do droppers for the setup of your rig. I'm going to sit down so you can see it. So first, let's say this is going to the fly line and this is going to be where your first fly goes on. So what we're going to do is throw another, this is the video we did before. Here's the Mac knot here. We're going to tighten that up and bring the fly back and through. So we have this set up. Alright, so we want to put a dropper to where the next fly comes off of this. So what I'm going to do is throw another one in here. Throw the tag in under, come over, come underneath through the big circle, hold it here. We're going to tighten that up. We're going to bring the middle, you still have to act like there's a fly on there even though there's not, to form this slip. Okay. So what we do is we drop that fly, let's say we want a dropper tag, usually I like six to eight inches. So I just tighten that up. There's the dropper. Now I'm going to use what's called a Davy knot. I'm going to tie this where the fly is back to the main part of the line. I'm going to throw that underneath, come over the top. I need to leave myself a little room with this key ring. We take that and that through and back and up. We're going to tighten this part down back to the other knot that was created. It comes off always 90 degrees. And with monofilament, that'll make a very small knot. And that's how we get our first dropper. We continue on for a three or four fly rig. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And I look forward to 